Hi, this is Joris from Ethercast. I'm going to show you how to install the, the Go Ethereum command line client from scratch. I'm using a, a recently installed uh, Ubuntu 14.10 virtual machine in, uh, on VirtualBox. Uh, besides changing the background image, I didn't actually do any customization. So this is really from the, from the start. So to do the installation, I'm going to follow the installation steps that are described on the Go Ethereum wiki under build instructions for Ethereum and then following the building for Linux steps because I'm on Ubuntu. For this I'm going to use the option 1 install from PPA because it's the, the easiest way to do it. Specifically I'm going to install the Ethereum comment line uh, clients just because the, the graphical user interface is not really usable. So I'll start a terminal. So I'll start a terminal and just copy paste some of these instructions here. So first of all I'll make sure that these software properties common tools are installed. As they are already installed by default, actually don't need to to do this step. I'm not using to, I'm not going to use the, the graphical user interface, so I can skip the Ethereum Qt dependency. And now I'm going to add the, the PPA repository for Ethereum and Ethereum Dev. And I want to have the latest one, the Ethereum Dev one, just so I can get the latest build. Alright, so now these repositories, repositories are available. Uh, I need to update my packages. And after this I can install the Ethereum CLI binary. Okay, now Ethereum is available and I can start an Ethereum client. Now my node is running. If you look on the, the wiki, you'll find more instructions like what command line options are there and out how, also how to use the, the JavaScript console. This is really useful for, uh, for local testing. You can start the Ethereum console and get some information about my node. For more instructions, check out the, the wiki.